Do either of you want to go? Sure, I guess we could take him off your hands. No, I'm going. One of you have to come with me. Oh, I'm probably busy. You are busy. My pajama party's tonight, remember? My mom's been planning it for a month. She made sleeping bag-shaped invitations and everything. That's tonight? I never got my invitation. Really? I mailed it to you here. I wonder where it went. Thanks for the lovely invite, True. <laughs> All right, let's break out Lama Lama Land and really get this party started. <laughs> what was that? What was what? All you guys looked at each other. Probably just a coincidence. OK, who wants to play first? <laughs> there it was again. What's going on? Don't you guys like Lama Lama Land? We like it. Then what's the problem? It's just that you get a little competitive when you play. No, I don't. <laughs> Sorry, Ryan. That gorge is dead end. Oh, man. The bridge is out. There's no way across. Another victory, yes! OK, uh, take your last turn until we can get this over with. I'm late for a tea party with Lulu. <laughs> Power of flight? All I have to do is fly across the gorge and I win! Maybe I do get a little competitive. When we were in the fifth grade, you almost blinded Carrie Burke. That's why she wore an eye patch that year. It wasn't because she loved pirates. <laughs> well, fine. I don't have to play if no one wants to play me. I'll play you. Five minutes, and we're going to turn off the lights. It's getting late. Dana! Sweetie, uh, there's some barbecue sauce that's spilled in the kitchen. Mop it up, will you? <laughs> I'm in the middle of a very important game. But it's bedtime, sweetheart. <laughs> Where were we? I believe you were about to lose, no? Not even close. <laughs> wow, you're just as competitive as True is. That is an insult. I'm much more competitive. <laughs> How dare you? Nobody beats me. I'm the best. The best! <laughs> you're a scary lady. Why, thank you. How about we make this a little more interesting? What do you have in mind? Loser has to take the other to lunch for a week. I hope you like carnival food. Maybe you guys should just pause the game until tomorrow morning. It's really late. I bet everyone in the city's asleep right now. I don't understand what's going on. Normally, I'm awesome at Mama Lama Land, but for some reason, I can't beat Amanda. I have a confession to make. Promise you won't be mad? OK. Promise? Yeah. You're not that awesome at Llama Llama Land. What are you talking about? I haven't lost a game since I was eight. That's because we've all been letting you win. You said what now? <laughs> Why would you guys do that? You're kind of a bad sport when you lose, so we figured if you never lost. What are you girls still doing up? Mom, do you and Dad let me win at Llama Llama Land? Oh, that's the silliest thing I've ever heard. We would never. She knows. We do it all the time. Mom. I'm sorry, sweetie. But you can be a bit of a hothead when you lose. I have no idea where that temper comes from. Hello? What do you mean you're at the border? What border? Describe the flag, Larry. Describe the flag! <laughs> Hello? <laughs> that was your daddy. He's either in Mexico or Canada. Either way, his good suit out on the street. <laughs> How come you never told me I was too competitive? I guess we didn't want you to lose your drive. My drive? Your drive to succeed. It's one of the reasons you're a 16-year-old vice president. It's part of who you are. An ugly part. It can be. You just have to learn how to control it. A person isn't measured by how many wins they have. It's how they handle their losses. Now, that would be good on a pillow. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. You're welcome, baby. Back for more? Let's do this. <sighs> Advance to the gate of the golden pan flute. I can't believe this. One more space and true wins. Switch places with your opponent and advance one space. I win. I win! <gasps> 
Congratulations, Amanda. You played a great game. Thank you. You want to flip the game board over, don't you? A little. Go ahead. <laughs> Best two out of three. <laughs>